Islam, Dwayne Baffer Bay. It is October the 14th, um, 2018. Islam, how are you doing? I hope well. Um, I'm going to start off by reading the Holy Quran. The opening. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Praise be to Allah. The Lord of the Worlds, the Beneficent, the Merciful, Master of the Day of Requital, Thee do we serve, and Thee do we beseech for help. Guide us on the right path, the path of those upon whom Thou hast bestowed favors, not those upon whom wrath is brought down, nor those who go astray. I'm starting off reading 98, Clear Evidence. Chapter 98, Clear Evidence. It says, In the name of Allah, It says, um, in the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful, those who disbelieve from among the people of the book and the idolaters could not have been free till clear evidence came to them. A messenger from Allah reciting pure pa pages, wherein are all right books, nor did those to whom the book was given become divided till clear evidence came to them and they are enjoined not by to serve Allah being sincere to him in obedience upright and to keep up prayer and pay the poor rate and that is the right religion those who disbelieve from among the people of the book and the idolaters will be in the fire of hell, abiding therein. They are the worst of creatures. Their reward is with their Lord, gardens of perpetuity wherein flow rivers abiding therein forever Allah is well pleased with them and they are well pleased with him that is for him who fears the who fears his Lord chapter 99 the shaking in the name of Allah the beneficent the merciful when the earth is shaken with her shaking and the earth brings forth her burdens. And men says, What has befallen her? On that day she will tell her news. And if thy Lord had revealed to her, On that day men will come forth in sudry bodies, That they may be shown their works. So he who does an atom's weight of good will see it. And he who does an atom's weight of evil will see it. That's the shaking. Chapter 100, the assaulters. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, by those running and uttering cries, 
and those producing fire, striking, and those suddenly attacking at morn. Then thereby they raise dust, then penetrate their gatherings. Surely man is ungrateful to his Lord, and surely he is a witness of that. And surely on account of the love of wealth, he is niggardly. Knows he not when that which is in the graves is raised. And that which is in the breast is made manifest. Surely their Lord this day is aware of them. One on one, this is the Holy Quran again, the calamity. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful, the calamity. What is the calamity? And what will make thee know how terrible is the calamity? The day wherein men will be as scattered moths and the mountains will be as carded wolves then as for him whose measure of good deeds is heavy he will live a pleasant life and as for him whose measure of good deeds is light the abyss is a mother to him and what will make thee know what this is? A burning fire. Chapter 102, The Abundance of Wealth. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful. Abundance diverts you until you come to the graves. Nay, you will soon know, nay, again, you will soon know, nay, would that you knew with a certain knowledge. You will certainly see hell, then you will see it with certain certainty of sight, then on that day, you shall certainly be questioned about the boons. Okay. I'm going to stop there. Okay, now I'm going to read the time. 103. In the name of Allah, the beneficent, the merciful. By the time, surely man is in loss, except those who believe and do good and exhort one another to truth. And exhort one another to patience. Islam. Now I'm going to read. Um, Okay, now I'm going to read what I learned through the teachings um, as I was um, studying from Asir and Selena. Um, this was um, in the year 2014. It's uh, I, I self-law self am master or Islam, but it's I dot S dot L dot A, A dot M dot. I self-law am master. I, from the creator of the universe representing mother and child from hence you came s each one of us is a trinity this being the symbol of civilization s 
itself. L, which is law. The length, angle, and width of the cosmic energies that mark you. A, which is am. The joining at two trinities, male and female principles. The triune which creates another I am. M, this being the glyph for the planet Earth on, of which we are on and aspire to be master navigators of, upon. Master navigators upon. Okay. Okay. Allah, my highest self. Now, I'm going to continue to read. And this is also, if you're listening to Wayne Bapil Day, this is also to you, Islam. Okay, so now I'm going to read. Um, finish. I left off with the Holy Quran, on the Holy Quran Circle 7. Um, I'm going to read um, I'm just going to start off reading again um, 28 it says magistrate and subject O thou the favorite of heaven whom the sons of man and this is the holy Quran circle 7 whom the sons of men thy equals have agreed to raise to sovereign power and set as a ruler over themselves consider the ends and importance of their trust far more than the dignity and height of thy station once again it says and this is chapter 28 magistrate and subject i mean chapter 29 magistrate and subject O thou, the favorite of heaven, whom the sons of men, thy equals, have agreed to raise to sovereign power and set as a ruler over themselves. Consider the ends and importance of their trust, far more than the dignity and height of thy station. Thou art clothed in purple and set on a throne. It's a little um, blurry over here. The crown of majesty live, invested thy temples. The scepter of power is placed in thy hand. But not for thyself were these in signs given. Not meant for thy own but the good of thy kingdom. The glory of a king is the welfare of his people. His power and dominion rest on the hearts of his subjects. The mind of a great prince is exalted with the grandeur of his station. He involved all he involved high things and search for business worthy of his power. He called together the wise men of his kingdom. He consult among them with freedom and hears the opinions of them all. He looked among his people with discernment. He discovered the abilities of men and employed them according to their merits. His magistrates are just, excuse me, as I read, I'm at American Extended Stay in Annapolis, Maryland, and there are males speaking around the room, and I felt a sharp pain here. Um, it's October the 14th, 2018 in Annapolis, Maryland. His magistrates are just, his ministers are wise, 
and the favorite of his bosom deceive him not. He smile on the arts and they flourish. The sciences improve beneath the culture of his hand. With the learned and ingenious, he delights himself. He kindle in their breasts emu emulation, and the glory of his kingdom is exalted by their labors. The spirit of the merchant who extend his commerce, the skill of the farmer who enrich his lands, the ingenuity, ingenuity of the artist, the improvements of the scholar, all these he honored with his favor or reward with his bounty. He plant new colonies. He builds strong ships. He open rivers for convenience. He form harbors for, I can't read the word, it's, um, it's not printed completely. Abandoned and riches and the strength of his kingdom increased. He framed his statues with equity and wisdom. He subjects, enjoy the fruits of their labor in security. And their happiness consists of the observance of the law. He found his judgments on the principle of mercy, but in the punishment of offenders, he is strict and impartial. His ears are open to the, to the complaints of his subjects. He restrained the land, the hands of the oppressors, and he delivered them from their tyranny. His people therefore look up to him as a father with reverence and love. They consider him as the garden, guardian of all they enjoy. Their affections unto him beget in his breast a love of the public. The security of their happiness is the object of his care. No murmurs against him arise in their hearts. The machination of his enemies endanger not the state. His subjects are faithful and firm in his cause. They stand in his defense as a wall of brass. The army of tyrants flieth before them as shaft before the wind. Security and peace bless the dwellings, dwelling of his people and glory and strength encircle his throne forever Islam and this is called magistrate and subject okay. and that's gonna be it for right now I'm at 18 minutes and uh, almost 19 minutes Islam and once again I just read um, the Holy Quran um, chapter 98 to 103 on the Holy Quran circle seven and Islam I self law and master. <laughs>